Good morning everyone. In this video, we are going to be discussing the hamstring muscles. The hamstring muscles are the group of muscles that are located in the back of thigh region and they also follow a set of four rules to be called the hamstring muscles. The muscles are namely semitendinosus, semimembranosus, long head of biceps femoris and ischial head of adductor magnus. The rules are, they all should arise from the ischial tuberosity. They all should get inserted into any one of the bones of the leg, namely tibia or the fibula. They all should be supplied by the tibial part of the sciatic nerve and they all should be flexors of knee joint and extensors of hip joint. Now, let's take a look at the muscles. We have semitendinosus which arises from the ischial tuberosity and gets inserted in the tibia in this region. Then we have semimembranosus which arises from the ischial tuberosity comes down to get inserted into the tibia. Then we have biceps femoris muscle which has two heads, long head and short head. The long head arises from the ischial tuberosity and the short head arises from the femur. Then that is why the long head is a part of hamstring group. As it comes down, it gets inserted into the head of the fibula. Then we have the adductor magnus muscle which again has two parts namely the hamstring part and the adductor part. The hamstring part arises from the ischial tuberosity as it comes down it gets inserted into the adductor tubercle of the femur. Now adductor magnus is called the modified hamstring the reason being as you can see it gets inserted into the femur. Now we have a ligament called as the tibial collateral ligament of the knee joint which is a degenerated tendon of adductor magnus which gets inserted in the tibia. So that is why this is a modified hamstring muscle. Now all of these four muscles are supplied by tibial part of sciatic nerve and their actions are they flex the knee joint and extend the hip joint. Thank you.